base. But you're doing an Amigo points game that's very well known. Because I'm too Amigo. based. No, you have a real reason why you do an Amigo points game. Yeah, it's because I'm too based. Are you recording minors? I'm you too are based. I'm you're recording too minors. Based. I'm too based. You wouldn't understand. Uh, you're well, cringe. You're blue. No, you, no right, I'm, I'm based. based. Stop you're recording minors. You're Stop blue pill. Minus. I'm based. Get off the VPNs. You're blue pill. <laughs> Get off the VPNs. I'm gonna keep banning you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I live in uh, where did it say I live? Thailand or Japan? I don't this know. is Japan. Epic, very based. Yeah, I don't. I just keep banning <laughs> you because I really don't care. You keep banning me? Yeah, well, I don't care. What are you in contact know. with Leaf Brooks? Oh uh, no, I never said that. Now. Well, how else? That's what well, he's I'm, not gonna, I'm not going to tell you. I'm they send an uh, they send an email to Leaf Brooks and they just get me banned that way. No. And I'd have to IP hop. You cause me cause me a little trouble. I call you. I call we cause you a little trouble. <laughs> How unfortunate. We, we. Well, you said you, you said you caused me all trouble. I don't care. Stop making your amigo points game. Nah, bro. I'm too based. Chances are you probably have came across the so-called points games that starts out innocent enough and as you progress it becomes more apparent by the time it starts to ask the participant to remove a layer of clothing and in some instances going as far as asking to perform a little dance as if you're auditioning to perform lewd acts and believe it or not these points games are always aimed at minors as young as nine years old and the next thing you know are being sold to whoever will purchase these recordings of these minors or better yet could potentially blackmail their victims into submitting even more lewd content with little to no repercussion or regard to whoever they want to exploit so we'll cover the motives and how these points games are operated plus more so here it is welcome to land rider's seventh documentary on omegle points games a serious problem I like don't know any information, but it's kind of obvious. Like anyone who's into programming or anything like that can recognize what a bot is when they send it to sites, like random upload sites that sell for information like that, and they just, you know, upload to that. This is very um, uninformative, but uh, <laughs> it's kind of how it works. You understand, like, bots like. If you're online, you get skipped instantly. Like a bot that says, like, let your shirt to play game. That's what it is. For quick context, Omega is a video chatting website founded by Leaf K. Brooks in 2009. Users can access text or video chat with strangers, and this pertains to the video chatting section. Users can also enter keywords known as interests or tags and match other users on the same tag. For an example, if you and I both enter music, there is a chance we'd match. This isn't the guaranteed, given there can be thousands of other people online at the same time, and Omega tends to work on a rotation basis. However, if the tag is more specific, for example, Valorant, the video game, you'd be more likely to match a specific person or group of people. If you see something that is inappropriate or offensive, you are expected to disconnect or leave, also known as skipping, to match with someone new. However, there is no way to give the last person you spoke to feedback or make this known to moderation, which is widely known to be done by AI. So, anyhow, there is also no AI or specific action against minors, contrary to belief. There is no way Omega would risk lawsuits or litigations for scanning every user to ensure they are over the age of 18. The age gate has always been performative and was only added in October of 2022 after countless lawsuits. So as a reference point, in 2021, Omega filed over 
70,000 cyber tips, which is roughly 200 reports a day. Again, over 200 serious violations a day to law enforcement agencies. And up till 2021, there was a specific tagline on Omega's homepage that said, be careful, predators have been known to use Omega. Before that line got removed and changed Omega's age requirement from 13 plus to 18 or older. Certain tags on Omega have been banned, namely popular tags like Discord, 4chan, Andrew Tate, and the sexual orientated tags such as horny, daddy, sex, and other tags related to self-harm. You will know if you are on a banned tag if you see the you are chatting to a random stranger without the common word interest tags being displayed. Predators, of course, have been using alternative tags to link up with each other and their victims. However, Omega does have some flaws that could have been addressed a long time ago. For an example, there are specific tags that attract minors and ones that are essentially a honeypot for sexual activity. These tags will not be blocked because Lee fear that he'll be criticized as homophobic. But seeing firsthand the evidence that the overwhelming majority of points games are on these individual tags, like lesbian for instance, or the LGBTQ tags, and not the unmoderated section, and even then, Leaf refuses to take action. That being said, a lot of users raises the question on why the TikTok tag, a tag that is mostly populated by minors, or anyone that found out about Omega through content creators, of TikTok, and it's a good question with a simple answer. If the TikTok tag was blocked, Omega's user base would decline significantly. It is essentially a mix of minors, trolls, streamers, black screens, mingled with people from other countries, and, of course, predators. There is no specific or tangible expectation of what you'll see on the TikTok tag because it is such a generic tag with the most users, as well as the most segregated, so you're less likely to meet up with anyone else outside the TikTok tag. It doesn't matter if you have any other tag, you would only ever match with another user on the same tag. It's believed that this is to keep minors on the TikTok tag, and yet minors aren't even allowed to be on the website. But I digress. You could match and connect to someone from the same city as you or even across the world. There are individuals who uses simulated webcams to attract users, often minors, to partake in a quote-unquote game. Although simulated webcams are against the guidelines, users are able to use software such as ManyCams and OBS to create these so-called games, which do progressively become sexual in nature. The game would start off innocent enough, something like waving for 10 points, and gradually becomes more inappropriate as these challenges progress. There are hundreds, if not thousands, of examples of this game that can be custom made by a user or with the help of templates downloaded from the internet. So, after individuals takes part in this game, this is often recorded or streamed and then reposted or even sold on places on the internet, accessible to websites without any technical knowledge, such as adult websites. However, some users have been known to share packs and create this content in a professional manner for dark web purposes, which they leave barely any trace of their whereabouts. And some early examples of these points games dates as far back as 2013, in which the first points games has been seen. Yeah, this is how he's like, this is his very, like, this is his nickname on everything. <laughs> Worms with the Z. The watch out for him is a very. Fo uh, I'm guessing he's a techno, like techno nerd, like you. He enjoys uh, doing shit. Uh, I don't fucking know, man. Like, this guy is weird. Of all the predators I've been looking into, this guy has lowest profile, but also major effect. I think like half of the girls like traumatized on Omega is because of him. We came across this individual who we just nicknamed the Valorant Smiles guy in which the main image of the user displays text that says wave to play 
high score Abby 8,000 points. Can you beat her? Get the high score. Being sent, often encouraging minors to get involved by beating a quote unquote high score and would think waving and smiling or biting their lips are easy to do challenges before becoming inappropriate. He usually skips individuals who aren't his target audiences like males but will of course ask girls if they want to take part in the games and record the conversations from the start. This user was recorded in a 10 minute conversation where he describes how the game works and how he has over 800 or possibly more videos of which he has said are mostly minors getting naked as part of the games. He also said he sells the videos for cryptocurrency. This alone is an admission of creating and distributing illegal contents from Omega. The user does use VPNs or a VPS provider which are are connected in locations such as Russia or South Korea. So in this clip, he has spoken at length to a decoy female that was involved in the research and investigation into these predators. It was another girl. She was kind of, I don't know. She was like your level of cuteness, but she has bigger. T What's going on? Wait, what's going on? Wait, wait, wait. You're what am I playing? I'm, I'm talking. You're playing nothing. We're having oh, a conversation. Okay. I don't want you to play. Because <laughs> I have post, I have post nut syndrome. That means I'm not interested in women anymore. Oh. I'm into people. Oh, it's giving bro. He's a All right. Your pretty face isn't making me trying to get you naked anymore. You okay. See what I'm saying? Anymore? You're just not a okay. person anymore. Okay. Yeah, because it was just like a minute ago. But don't worry about that. Look at you. You look. You, you look smart. Thank you. Wait, at what least, at least someone would think you were smart. So think yeah. of something. Think of something to ask or what? Yes. What is this? What 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 do you mean? Wave to play. It's a game. It's a game to get girls naked and I jerk off to it. That's it. Why do you bite your lip when I, I say I, that? I didn't mean it like that. I mean, it was like a yikes. You bite oh, your lip. It was like it was it was like a yikes. You can say you didn't mean Wait, it. I love you it. Say How you does he get naked? No, go on. I was like a yikes. Do people actually fall for this? Yeah. Girl prettier than you. Wait wait. So you just like. Get people naked on Bro, a video? alright, this, this is how it goes. Alright, mm. imagine I come in the conversation, I just see you, I just say, wait. And if, if the girl is being like sassy and be like, nah, 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 nah I ain't gonna do that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Someone like that, I just, just go away and go to the next one. Plenty of fishing to see. What the way? And there's other girls who are like really submissive and really like that. And uh, you know, particular trick I use is uh, go wave, wave for like a second. I tell you to wave, no. do it. Okay, you wait for a second, I was like, I, and I'll say, I didn't tell you to stop. And girls really like that for a second. Like, I, I tested that, I made like a spreadsheet <laughs> of like when I said that, and when I didn't say it to the girls who liked you, you it. Have, you have a lot of free time, don't you? Bro, I just quit my job. Don't worry about that. Um, my point is that they really like when I say it, when you say, oh, I didn't tell you to stop, or something, or something like that. Mm -hmm. Uh, I don't know what else to tell you. You got some more questions? Um... Why are you on Valorant? Yeah, why are you on the Valorant tag? Because there's... There's you on there. There's money, pretty girls on there. They're not like five years old. Money. I'm not trying to see kids. I'm trying to see... Say so you're 15. Does that make sense? What if I'm like 15? <laughs> based. What do you mean based? He likes to talk, get out of there, man. Based on what? What are you talking about? How old are you? What do you mean? Don't worry about that. What are you asking me my age, you pedophile? Get out of here. I do, I just came. Matter of fact, I'll show you the video. Give me a moment. Sell it for like money, for like crypto. Oh, so yeah. So give me a moment. There's items in it. So I gotta find the right one I just came to. She was a really sweet girl. Really nice. Poor girl though, don't you feel bad? No, absolutely not. Like, I don't respect her, but she's really cute. You trying to tell me you guys would understand? Yes. Absolutely. Oliver? What? <laughs> like, uh, uh, for example, I'm you f 100 guys, your body count is not 100. You still are cute, but you're a f Yeah, I told you. What, 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 what about, like, what about, like, guys? Sorry, it's my cat. He, he opened the door. Well, there's a difference between doing what's hard and doing what's easy. If you're a woman and you sleep with 100 guys, doing what's easy. That's why nobody appreciates it. And that's why nobody likes you after. That's why people call each other sl Especially girls call each other sl I'm trying. I'm trying to f***ing fill the time so I can show you this video, because I kind of want to flex. But I don't want to see it. You'll, you'll enjoy, enjoy it. Trust me, it was epic. How old was she? She could have been like what? You'll see. 
you agree with me that you'll say it's fine. But and you're not gonna disprove me on this. Even if you she's safe enough, this is what you'll think. You say, oh, God damn, nice. That's what you'll say. Or you'll think. Right, makes Why are you acting so nervously with your hands? Sorry, I'm like really you're nervous. Honest. Well, nervous about what? I don't know, just talking to people it makes me nervous. <laughs> Even if it's online. Uh, kinda weird, bro. Anyway. Here we go. This is the girl right here. No, Boom. No, no, no. And here's the game. That's the game. Basically, that's what the girl is seeing after the wave part. What the f*** are you looking at your door? Are your parents gonna come in and bust you talking to some yeah. internet weirdo? I'm, I'm terrified, I'm terrified, honestly. Alright, anyway, base. Uh, let me look at this. Boom. Boom. And I'm talking to her, just like I'm talking to you. So that's basically it. Okay. What do you think? Are you a bit, are you a bit out of, uh, what do you call that? Speechless. You're speechless. I'm, I'm fucking You're speechless. flabbergasted, what the fuck? You're flabbergasted. You've never seen someone like this before. And I'm being like open hearted with you now. But if I came, like what I do is I have a plugin where I can block people. I can block IPs on Amigo. So I block every guy that I see. So I only get girls. Mm -hmm. So I get the same girls over and over in a cycle. And some girls I get, I like coerce them into it. But like, you know, you know when people like on Discord, like groom. No, I'm not. I bet you leave. What's he? That would never happen to yeah, me. He's Oh, yeah. that would never... No, but it would. But it would. Don't entertain this. Dude, I'd, I'd, I'd never fall for something that stupid. Honestly, like I'd you never... say that now you won't because you know how it works. No, because I knew before. Everyone knows. Oh, you stupid idiot! Whoa. I'm not. I'm not gonna push this. I'm not gonna push. If that, if you were my daughter, I would slap the fuck out of you if you did that. For to free? <laughs> Goddamn. Well, I'd feel confident if I didn't. No, fuck no, a no, you that. wouldn't. No. All right, what were you trying to say? Come Don't on. be a f with this. Bro, I call my girlfriend. Too. What are you talking about? You have a girlfriend? I have a girlfriend? No. I literally no, have one. No, you don't have a girlfriend. Oh, no, you, you could. The weird internet weirdo couldn't have a girlfriend. That's impossible. That couldn't happen. Not with these linguistic skills. They couldn't get a girlfriend. No, sir. She f***ing sim for me, too. That's the funny part. She f***ing messaged me first. Anyway. Poor girl, she's really cute, and she's really nice, and we have a good time together. You know, tomorrow we're gonna carve pumpkins out for Halloween. So wholesome. I'm gonna have my children with her. And you know what they're gonna be? They're gonna be like me, and they're gonna have future use to exploit. All so right. your audience listening in? Yeah. So I'd like them to know. This Omegle, right, right for this thing. Honestly, get on here. You, I mean, this girl's on Omegle. All these other girls are on the Valorant tag. They're all beautiful. Why don't you talk to them? Yeah, well, girlfriend. Why, why are you trying to talk to other ladies, man? Because I'm a base guy, and sometimes base I need to go extra. Ass. You know what a base no, guy kidding. is? Someone no, that stays kidding. loyal, man. Dad, I'm not loyal. Yeah, if, you're not if base. If my girlfriend finds out I'm cheating, uh, f dude, I'll say, you know, I, I use the girls for sex, but I love you. Like, oh, just how I use the girl I showed you. Yeah. You got some finishing remarks? And I feel bad for your girlfriend. She should break up with you. The other poor girl, I can't believe she fell for that. Um, bro, 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 there's more. There's, hold on, let me count here. No, no I don't no, have to no, count. count, count 838. Yeah, skip. Yeah, just skip, bro. Why are you still here? Why are you entertaining him? Alright, alright. That's the same level that I showed you. Alright, you know what, you know what, it's like Anyways, peace out, you Peace suck. out. One of the distributing websites that we came across happens to host points games templates called CamGag, where you can purchase all the tools needed as if you're purchasing any other software. And from the looks of this, there's a good chance that this website is hosted outside of any jurisdiction that would otherwise be considered illegal. And on the same website, it also sells these pre-recordings of these women or quote-unquote models called VCWs, which uses an automated system system where you can make those pre-recordings perform some actions as simple as a press of a button in which we're not too sure if these are consenting adults or minors and these VCWs are often used to blackmail unsuspecting victims in order to get them to remove their clothing so they can record and extort them for money if they don't pay up and they'll send it to people that they know or anyone else for that 
that matter. And it's easy to see why this is such a problem. So not only can this be used towards unsuspecting adults, they can be specifically aimed at unsuspecting minors that into giving in to these demands where the VCW can show what's underneath its clothing in exchange for the victim to do the same. And the next thing you know, the individual operating the VCW can use those recordings to blackmail and to spread the recording around to really anyone. And if they have a hold of their personally contact information or someone they know, like a school for instance, that's when they got what they wanted and they're in control. And for the victim, that would be a very scary situation to be in. And who knows how many victims has this website contributed towards the rise of simulated webcams used for either grooming or blackmailing anyone into giving in into their urges that resulted in Omega's predator problem for all these years, which shut down on November 8, 2023. And since then, thousands upon thousands of users had spread out through other websites and apps. And that also includes the predators operating these points games, started editing the aspect ratio, zooming out the camera, or even not using the camera to display points game, but actually the text. For example, a predator might say, wait, wave to play the points game. Around December 2022, a consistent method of avoiding the AI moderation of Omega webcam screenshot was patched, which saw a steep decline in users. We calculated about 30%. There's also small caveats, things like Omega absolutely inflating their numbers. We all know that there aren't as many users as they say they are. Omi TV is another example of this. They constantly claim to have a hundred thousand users online at any given time. The old generation of Omega, where you could see a watermark on the person's camera, stranger, the mute button, or take snapshot on somebody's camera. And of course, the old generation Omega logo determines that you're looking at an old points game video. You can also tell by the subtle nuance of the video. For example, is the user pixelated blurry? Is it low frames per second? Some predators record full screen and you can often see their browser configuration. For an example, old operating system versions of browsers or even a timestamp from the windows in the bottom right and etc. Another way to know if a video is ancient or from an old generation is if the tag in the video shows is inaccessible. For example, a video might show a female and male matching on the horny tag. So you know this isn't a recent video as tags like that are blocked. There are also specific groups who share and trade content of points games and other sexual content of Omega. It mostly is individual users who are running the points games with final levels of the game being that the user joins in and masturbates with the female. But there were substantial rumors of telegram groups and coordinated predator groups using Omega to push points games. Example, the anime and Disney type points games. Templates are also widely shared for the points game, but they are not hard to make. Again, since predators use programs like OBS and Manicam to output the games, a user could absolutely make their own custom version in Photoshop, GIMP, Paint, etc. You don't require any skills, and some don't really put a whole lot of effort that these predators use text to say, level one, blow a kiss, for instance. Obviously, the more professional and quote-unquote fun a game looks, the more likely for users and victims to take part of. The majority of these games are recorded and then posted on adult websites. However, this is where things go down the rabbit hole. Pornhub is probably the most mainstream pornographic website, and up till late 2021, users could freely search up Omega and see videos of points games, various people masturbating. After revenge porn and the lack of clarity of consent of these people having their masturbation videos posted online, Pornhub wiped 80% of its hosted videos. This included Omega and similar video chatting websites. So this effectively means two things. The first is that if you go on Pornhub and search Omega, you will receive a warning of potentially looking up content where minors have suffered harm or abuse. This is not a legal notice and there are no consequences for the initial search. But as you probably are aware, repeated or patterned searches of this type of content will likely flag you to law enforcement and respective authorities. Secondly, this means that pornographic content of Omega has gone underground. Some websites still host these videos. They are mostly videos from the old generation of Omega and not current. It also means there are dedicated platforms to this type of illegal content, which also is 
established a clear market for pornographic videos on places like Tor, Telegram, and the deep dark web. You are very unlikely to stumble across these types of videos, and they have become an acquired taste, meaning users actively seek out this type of content. Also trade videos, and there are often marketplaces for exchanging pornographic content, which can also include the victim's IP addresses, chat logs, and social media, if they provided during the original conversation. Although these points games and bots are created by fringe individuals or groups, there happen to be a very specific bot which advertises a sex website, orange and black font, a female in underwear bending over with no face shown, which this website domain has Omega in it. And the interesting part is that there is no IP address for that particular bot. Doesn't display an IP address whatsoever, meaning that these bots are hard embedded into Omega itself and is likely condoned or even installed by Leaf K Brooks. And so another valid question arises: if Omega is considered an LLC as of 2020, a business which files tax reports yearly to comply with federal law, and yet Leaf doesn't think a sex website is somehow negatively affecting its perception or even copying their trademark to be infringed on their intellectual property? In that case, my guess is as good as yours. And finally, the unmoderated section. Per the home page, advertisement features no moderation. If a user is banned, they can only access the unmoderated section. Predators have shown contents such as animal abuse and minors doing unspeakable things and other horrible materials all without consequences in which the unmoderated section does not feature the AI snapshot system or process that the regular Omega video chat has. All in all, Omega's dangers are real that the website itself had to be shut down, completely eradicating any chances of minors getting groomed or even worse. And even though Omega isn't around anymore, other video chatting websites do in fact exist and whatever has been used on Omega can potentially be used on these other websites as well. So if you do ever come across a points game screen or any other potential child predator, it's best to grab their location using an IP logger and report it to the proper authorities. If you do come across a minor, do the best you can to tell them to leave the website if they stated that they are underage or simply skip them in which the chances of them coming across a predator may increase if they haven't been warned beforehand. This wouldn't have been possible without the support of those who volunteer to provide information as well as the screenshots and special thanks to those that donated and further contributed in providing sources to make this video possible. Till then, this is LR7 talking about the Omega Points game and the bot problem and logging out. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I'm too based. I'm too based. Show me all the points you have. You're blue pill. Oh shit. Show me all the world we have two kinds of people. Show me all the points you have. After you've been so rude to me, no, you're blue pill. You're cringe. I'm sorry about this, sir, but you're too cringe. All right, you're blue pill. All right, you go for the blue Slurpee. I go for the red Slurpee. I eat spicy food. You eat mayonnaise. I do. That's right. Miners, I know you are. Why won't come on? <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, I'm. I'm just letting you know ahead of time. Yes, I am recording. So, if, if there's anything you would like to say, anything. I don't know. I'm based. Yeah. I'm. I'm red pill. You'll find no, me on you're uh, a pedophile. the tag. You're a pet this guy's on. If you want to talk you're to me. You're a predator. Me. You're All a right. pedophile. You are sick. No, you, no. No. Yes, you not are. Not true. I'm just too yes. based. You wouldn't no, understand. No, you are the biggest point in game. She <laughs> no. was a pedophile. And to the audience, if you want to have a talk with me, that's not so rude as what? like this guy is. You can live visit me on these tags. This guy is going to tell you I'm on, and it's going to be really based and cool. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh no! See you later. All... No, 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 